What? You know what that reminds me of? This is like that, uh, you go to like Burger King. Do you know what I'm talking about? Or McDonald's, I think the it crown? was. And they had, not the crown. They, McDonald's had like, uh, oh my God. The, uh, it was like you get your Happy Meal and it was like a spaceship and it had stickers and it was a big plastic thing. And yes. Was, remember that thing? We're old, we're old. Yeah. Wait, who is this guy? Clyde. I have no idea. Clyde is from Sarah Jane Adventures. <gasps> so I don't. Aww. She is the best. She is the best. I want to give her a big hug like that, too. Anytime she does any kind of video or tweet or anything, it just fills me with joy. So yeah. protect her at all costs, as they say. Oh, the doctor's junk drawer. It looks uh, highly inappropriate. I don't think that's... <laughs> this is where he hides them. <laughs> now, this is, uh, we should say for people, this is the three doctors, right? Don't remember yes. anything about that. Other I than think there it was, was three of them. Omega was in it. It was the one when uh, Hartnell couldn't actually be there, and didn't they? It was like he was only on a screen <laughs> yes. the whole time. It was just, that that they just took a Polaroid and uh, scotch taped it to the wall. <laughs> they had to cut out his mouth, and they just kept. Sweet Sarah Jane. I don't Aww. recall that at all. I don't remember that being a Sarah Jane nope. thing, but it's wonderful. You, Luke, Ronnie. The Ronnie. Uh, no, now, the next, oh, if, the is next that thing, thing going to automatically unlock and it's it's uh, Clive Barker? Yeah, it, uh, it, it's uh, the Hellraiser. Yep, it's the puzzle box. He's so nice, this whole thing takes a very dark turn. Oh, three, once. Well, no, three all at once, once. Well, no, actually, wait a minute, two and a bit. Two and a bit. The, See, the, the bit was the scotch tape picture you, yes. you referenced. Exactly. It, because it was a bit. They were doing a bit. See, if I had seen this before the end of the last finale, I would have been like, oh my god, Omega. Yeah. Omega is the answer to all of these things. That's who Mrs. And Flood is. Yet, Why is this thing nine minutes long? She's so busy, you know? Oh, Ronnie is not a guy. And what she does is important. What do I do? I just... I write daft comic book stories. Wait. But now we have to watch this, uh, Sarah Jane. It's about a comic book writer yeah. who's in love with the Ronnie. <laughs> wait, the, wait a minute. The, the Sarah Jane and Ronnie show. I don't know how we missed that. He's got a Ramana One poster on his wall. I don't have one, but if people wanted to send us a, a Ramana One poster, I would accept it. That really does sound like something for generative AI for you. Oh. No, I think I'll... I'd rather not. Just stay here a bit longer. See what other memories come to call. See if someone oh, more interesting shows up. Maybe she's hanging out and someone else is going to show up. Oh, yeah. She's like, this wasn't really she's that like, I'm going to be hang. here for a while. <laughs> good luck, my darling. Aw. Aw, oh, sweetie. I love her rings. She's got great rings. Wait, what? Did he just Sit in your thinking so chair. Oh. Wait, where, did, where did he go? He just slides right into that drawer. <laughs> I see. Oh, oh, he's inside the crystal. <gasps> The, the crystal. dark crystal. Oh, a crystal shard. She's very new age. She is. <laughs> this will absorb all the negative energy. Let's just have 20 more minutes of Joe sitting quietly in a chair. <laughs> Those beetles from the dark crystal are going to break <laughs> through the wall and drag oh, her away. I thought you meant the beetles from the, uh, oh, the musical yeah. episode. <laughs> sure. <laughs> there they are. <gasps> oh, Joe. <gasps> I heard who someone saying, oh, Joe, but I don't know whose voice that was. It uh, Was it Peter Davison? Was it... Uh, um, Clive Barker. Clive Barker. Was it her her, her fiancé husband, um, the uh, guy from the Weather Underground that was uh, going mm. after the, uh, on the Green Death, right? He was the radical yeah, uh, yeah. leftist school teacher. Right. Great character. Uh, that was her last episode. Dan, I have a lot of questions about this because you I watched can't answer Sarah a single Jane. One. I have, I watched like two episodes of Sarah Jane. And okay. I don't remember him. Was so. Joe Grant in that? Did they have a previous no, relationship? Not that, I, not that I know of. Okay. I mean, because the way must, they were they talking, really seemed it seemed like, like were... it seemed like they knew each other. He was talking about Ronnie. Now, what well, you said, I don't know what you're talking about. I was thinking, oh, is he in love with this guy named Ronnie? Because I assumed Ronnie. Was a guy's name like Ronnie Reagan or Ronald McDonald 
or mm. that guy from the Jersey Shore. But no, this must be a woman Who's named in Ronnie. With him, anyway. So. Uh, guess so. What else do you have to? Uh, what other what other deep I, insights do you have from this nine? I minute? got no deep insights, Dan. But what okay. I do have is a love of Joe Grant. Yes. Uh, Katie Manning. Who, over the course of reviewing all of those classic stories, I feel yes. like my love for her grew um, exponentially, mm. story to story to story. I feel like when we first started with her, it was like a big sort of shift from uh, East Berlin was the companion right before her, right? <laughs> yeah, I think so. Who was great, but then yeah. like it seemed like they were like, no, we want companions that scream more. So there was a lot of like early... Yeah, yeah. Joe Scream, but she's so delightful. Danger. Uh, I love her, and seeing this little bit here, mm -hmm. I, I wish she was in more of the new. Like I liked, I like when they're bringing back like older companions. Yeah, yeah. seems like she should be in unit. Everyone else is in unit. Yeah, what's just they got for little Joe child Rand. geniuses. She... And, yeah. yeah, I would like to see more of her. Well, I wish I knew yeah. something about this kid though. So like, I have no connection to when we did this episode i did not obviously we were watching it for the first time i didn't obviously. even know that name you were like who is this and i was like oh maybe it was going to be like some companion that was only on the three doctors that i didn't remember but he's a whole other character hey, he's also way too young to be in anything else so it kind of had. To yeah be. well but, i mean before i saw him you oh, just I said see. like the name i was, I was expecting an Got old you. man uh and not a young uh young fella who's in love with the ronnie Oh, who isn't? Oh, it was good. You. Too long. I, it felt very long. That, Speaking uh, of too long, nine minutes. I think we yes. can cut this. We did it. What? Folks. This, this, this is what we're in right now. This thing. Too long. Oh, you're done. Okay. Okay. We did. All right. Well, that's one way of ending. It. <laughs> <laughs> Not a good way. Uh, okay. All right. So that's so, uh, what, that was uh, Vicky subscribe? and Steve in the we'll TARDIS. Get, uh, the next one will be no, reviewing uh, Sarah Jane Adventures. And then after that, we're going to be putting together our own puppet show versions of the failed K9 and Company Ooh. series. Yes. But the next so. one is Vicky and Steven in the TARDIS. Now, we remember Steven. Steven was the, in very the, few the, episodes. He was the guy that was like the cowboy guy yeah. in the one where Hartnell got mouth surgery, right? He was the rocket. Yes. He landed on a rocket and had a stuffed animal yes. that he cared for. And Vicky, I remember, was also from the Hartnell era, right? They're yes, both in it. <sighs> that sounds so like they're doing the fun. Time Meddler. I, I don't remember the Time Meddler. Uh, that was one of I the very first ones we did. did. It. Yeah. Yeah. So it's got I know the no Time... Yeah, Time... Mind this Robber is what I'm thinking of. The Mind Robber, I remember. But this is the Mind Time Robber. Meddler. Huh. Is this right? Anyway, until next time, uh, we are the old Doctor Who show. Oh, if you're still here, buy my freaking <laughs> book. It just came out on Tuesday. Um, and so if you're overseas, uh, buy it, please. Yeah. Get our uh, Amazon rank up on Amazon.co.uk. Rise. Rise. Um, yeah, that's it. Cool. Time, Edler. Where's my robot? You know? <laughs>